Estimetric strength tester, and uh, I can break some fabric on this for you now. And we'll determine the strength and the elongation of this strip of fabric. Normally we would cut this fabric wider than 50mm and fray it down to 50mm. This is a coated fabric, or a laminated fabric, so we're just stuck with the less accurate method of cutting as accurately as we can to 50mm wide. So that's the sample in there. Just as I put the sample in there, I pulled down gently on the lower end of the sample, to give us a slight pretension, that just makes sure that the extension is an accurate figure. And now I'm going to start the test by pressing strain and peak hold. And peak hold will freeze the maximum force of the sample, which will be the force at break. Put my finger by this stop button here, and when the fabric sample breaks, I'll stop the test. Kilograms for 70, it should break about 100. 84, 85, there we go. That's the test done. Um, that broke at a, a force of 88 kilograms force with an extension of 58 millimeters. Press the return button, that brings the crosshead back down. and then we can remove the sample. And the sample here is a Gore-Tex, a three layer Gore-Tex laminate. And on that we've got a, a knitted backing. We've got the woven front, the outer layer of the, uh, the fabric, which will be the outer layer of a jacket. And in between this white layer you can see is a PTFE layer. This is Gore-Tex, as it were, and that's how I test done. On a British standard test, we'd repeat that five times in the warp direction and five times in the weft direction to get the warp and weft strength of the fabric.